Hello, everybody, and welcome on in. Happy March. It's March, guys. It's kind of hard to wrap my head around that. Like, to be honest, it's weird. It's weird. But, like, we're already two months into the year. Like, I can't honestly tell if this year is going by, like, fast or slow. But it's go, it's moving. We'll put it that way. Um, but it's March. There's so many things happening in March for me personally and just in general. It, guys, okay, in like 20 days, in exactly 20 days, Animal Crossing: New Horizons will be turning four years old. How do we feel about that? That's the most disgusting thing I've ever said in this world. Um, what the flip? Four years old, right? Like that's older than Peachy. Like, this is crazy. That's crazy. I, I can't think, I can't, I can't process it. We'll put it that way. Like, I feel like it's like four is a lot. Like maybe two, three for pushing it. Four though, that's weird. That's really weird. Either way, I am very excited for March. Spring is going to be sprunging. That's super exciting. Um, it will be like spring also in like 20-ish days. Like it'll officially be spring. Um, probably not weather-wise. I feel like nobody actually gets spring weather until like, late april to like may you know that's definitely when it kicks in but it's we can still say it'll be spring like it's still spring i guess it's common for it to snow in spring or something it depends i feel like march is still very early for it to be spring but i also still work with animal crossing logic in terms of like the three month season scale it's giving the 30 days for every month if you know you know either way today's tuesday <laughs> so before i yap anymore i'm gonna get the poll up on the screen once again, you have a lot of options, nine to be specific, of games we can play today. All you have to do to vote is chat the number to the left of the option you want. I think you only get one vote again today. No, I'll change it. I'm sorry. Don't vote yet, guys. We're changing it. Um, let me make sure everyone gets two votes because it that's always what we do and I'm going to switch it real quick. Okay. Poll is going back up. It should be ready to go. Okay. So, <laughs> you have nine options of games we can play today. All you have to do to vote is just chat the number to the left of the option you want to vote for and you do get two votes this time so you can vote for two different options once i don't believe you can vote for the same option twice though and keep in mind what you're voting for make sure you're not voting for things you don't want to vote for um because it will it will be very sensitive and will count it if you say the name or a number that is <laughs> associated with one of the other options so i'm gonna let you guys do that um if new horizons does win we will be playing on the new island I have made so much progress on that new island. It's wild. It is so wild. And um, I don't even know how to like put it into words. Like I said that it was going to be like an on stream and off stream moment. Like it's pretty wild, but it's definitely been a lot more off stream, which is like not what I wanted, but I can't resist because it's Animal Crossing and I needed to play Animal Crossing, like my life depended on it. So there's so much to unpack. I'm gonna break it down for you what I have done off stream if you guys are interested in seeing it because I told you I was gonna keep you updated with anything that happened. First off, we're getting Town Hall. Well, I, that's like a big step, like oh, right away. Um, it's not built yet. I just got the announcement it will be built. So tomorrow it'll be closed. Sunday, it'll open up for the first time. So on Monday's Animal Crossing stream, we will be seeing the Town Hall. Um, and then also, in order to get the town hall, I did get three villagers. Freckles we found on stream, I believe. So she has moved in with the two other villagers who I'm not going to announce. One of them I did a villager hunt for. The other one was an accident, but I am very happy with who I got. So they, they both moved in. The last one just moved in today. So super exciting. But I, I love them both. The random one is growing on me, but the two that I villager hunted for, Freckles and the other one, I love them. Um, also, we did get the shop i don't believe i did that on stream i think i was working towards that on stream but i didn't actually end up doing that but we um did get the shop so super exciting i paid off my house i do i do remember we did that on stream so i had my house and i upgraded it one so it's one size bigger and i'm currently working on upgrading it a second time um i got the museum tent and I'm upgrading the museum as well. I was really contemplating deciding on if I wanted to keep the tent or upgrade to the building of the museum. But I, yeah, I just gotta say, I'm pretty confident in my decision of upgrading it. So I got all of the like species that I needed donated to Blathers. And so that'll also be closed tomorrow and then opening Sunday, I believe. Um, 
both my villagers, so we have Sheldon and Renee. They got houses as well. I unlocked fencing. Um, I think... I, I also made a bridge. I mentioned that before last stream. I have access with a ladder and vaulting pole now to other areas of my island. I cleaned them up today. I was playing a little bit today, um, but there's still so much to do. I definitely, if that does one today, it's looking like it's in the lead, but in general, I definitely want to visit Harv's Island because that's one thing that I think will be very helpful. Um, I also got a lot of like small things. So like the upgraded tools, new hairstyles, lots, a lot of things from the Nook Stop, which are really helpful. Got a lot of new clothes, like not a lot of new clothes and furniture and such. So that's really helpful. <laughs> and let's see, anything else? I think I'll have to like, you guys will have to tell me if anything you've seen Animal Crossing is like new because I, I have done so much, it's wild. But that's a pretty rough like breakdown of what I have been doing in the game. I've been grinding. It's been very fun. It's all I can do as well because I can't use social media and that's my only entertainment. So Animal Crossing is back up again, like in my head, that's what I'm doing. I've been playing online land a lot too, customizing, remodeling, um, and just doing dailies because I, I also love that island. So I've been like going back and forth. If you see me on Animal Crossing or see me go offline Animal Crossing and right back on, I'm probably switching islands because it'll show up as the exact same and there's absolutely no way you can tell what island I'm playing on. But um, if you haven't seen me play Animal Crossing a lot, that's that's why. Um, but yeah, okay. That's, that's the Animal Crossing breakdown. So super excited about that. Uh, announcements though. First off, I will have a new video out on YouTube this Sunday. I put a poll up on my YouTube asking what video you guys wanted to see and going to a mall in New Horizons 1. So if you want to see that, be sure to check out my channel, my YouTube channel, Polywog Nintendo, on Sunday uh, for that new video. It's going to be really cute. I have a bunch of ideas in my head of how I'm going to um, create that. Also, next Wednesday, March 6th, Wobble Dude and I are going to be doing a collab stream. I'm so super excited for it. It's going to be for Mario March. And we're going to be playing some Mario Party Superstars. So if that sounds fun to you and you want to join, please feel free to do so. If not, you probably will want to join because it's going to be Mario Party with a twist. So you guys are going to have the ability to sabotage us. And I think that's going to be so super fun, but also very frustrating for the two of us. So if you either want to help us or sabotage us, you, you have full ability to do that. It's going to be through a channel point redemption option. And you guys have the ability to tell us what you want us to do. So you can tell us to steal stars from people, pass up buying stars, um, choose certain mini games, go certain ways, like use certain items on certain people. Like it's going to be pretty wild and we can't resist. So if somebody in my chat tells me I have to pass up a star, I can't resist and I have to agree. Like that's the rule and vice versa. So for Wobble Dude, if somebody tells him the same thing, he has to agree. Like there's no... Um, there's, there's no, you can't, you can't resist it. And I think it's gonna be really fun, but also very like, oh my goodness gracious. I, I'm already really bad at Mario Party, if you even can be. I just don't have luck with games. And I think we've all like come to this conclusion a really long time ago. But when it comes to board games, which is also another reason, like I'm not a bad sport. I also am not competitive until I do things like that. And I'm like, oh, I am. But when it comes to like board games, phys like physical games, when like, you know, like, card games or even like um a anything and it's like hide and seek i don't care what it is if there's a game if it is considered a game i suck at it so mario party i don't like it because one it is in the board game form and i'm also i've like never won a mario party game maybe i have before but it wasn't that memorable probably because i like blocked it out because the whole round was like so traumatizing but um I think that's gonna make it a lot worse for me, but I'm also looking so forward to it. You don't even know like that's all I gotta say um, But yeah, that's gonna be so super fun It'll be at normal time 5 p.m. Central time and run for about two hours So if you're able to make it and want to I would definitely recommend that um, Also speaking of wobble dude wobble dude is going to be doing his first charity stream on March 23rd It is going to be to support the charity of partners in health, which for those of you who aren't familiar with that charity It is a charity that supports um healthcare in developing nations so if that looks like something you want to support then i would definitely check it out he's gonna be playing some mario odyssey and the stream depending on how much money he earns it's gonna run to up to like 10 hours it's gonna be crazy but um even if you're not willing to support the charity or your money's tight or anything like i would definitely still recommend it checking it out going to support him because he is just tons of fun for sure um so i do want to say that because i know wobble dude's very excited about that as am i so wanted to let you guys know but other announcements, I feel like I got nothing. Like, I feel like it's been pretty nothing, but 
There was definitely something I was going to tell you guys. Do I know? No. It'll come to me eventually. <laughs> if, if there was something, I will be thinking about it. I caught a sturgeon in Animal Crossing. That was pretty wild. It was one of those like crazy fish you only get from like the mouth of the river. Um, and I put it in my house. Like there's no way I'm selling that bad boy for, I think it, I think they sell for like 9,000, somewhere, somewhere around there. Um, I was not re like ready to sell him. So I put him in my house. My house is super cute by the way, guys. Um, as are my new villagers, I will say, if you guys are watching this, you can't hate on my new villagers because I love every single one of them. And even Sheldon. I know you guys are Sheldon haters. I'm a Sheldon lover. So you guys can't be mean to my villagers because they're all very cute. And I think they fit the theme. I do think they fit the theme. Freckles, she's giving, she, she's giving, she ate everything. Not like literally, but she just, she's just good like that, you know? My other villager that I hunted eats gobbles. I absolutely adore, love them. And then the one that just happened to appear and I didn't realize that, they also eat. Like, I'm not gonna lie, they all do. And I don't even know how else to explain it. That's the only way I can explain it. I know that I'm explaining them the exact same because they are, well, they're nothing like alike, but it, it's, okay, it's a thought that counts. You guys will just have to see it because Animal Crossing did win the poll. Sorry to my fellow Celeste lovers, <laughs> uh, but we are going to take this poll off the screen. I'm not gonna chat for too much longer. We'll have to see how much I actually stick by that, but <laughs> um, I love the way the island's coming out. I, right now, I think the hair that I have is like the the braids with the bangs. I think that's what I have, but I'm switching it up all the time. I still get to decide on like a hair that I really wanna have for my default, but I'm really liking the way um, everything's laying out. Like, I'm not gonna lie, it's, it's eating. And I can't wait to actually start like full on redecorating my island like you know really not redecorating just decorating in general because i haven't decorated it yet but i am so excited to get into it so we're gonna be playing some animal crossing today but before we do i gotta catch up with chat for sure um question of the day before i do is if you could interview any celebrity who would it be this is a wild question because i have a lot of celebrities that i would really love to like interview or that i think would be really fun but i think um Let's see, I'm like two or three or four of them are kind of mine. Okay, first off, I think Taylor Swift obviously would be very fun. She would be a blast. So I can't even like, that's not, we had to just remove her because that would already be my automatic answer. And that's already like, like a cheat. Like she's, if, if I couldn't interview Taylor Swift, um, probably, this is so random. This is the most random answer in the world. Also, by the way, guys, there's no, you, I'm not being picky with this answer. They could be dead or alive. Like we're gonna, I'm gonna say that by the way. Like they don't have to be anyone who's living. Um, but I feel like Katy Perry would be really fun. Like I've been watching American Idol recently cause it just like the new season just started up and she's just the wildest person that I've ever seen in my life. And I feel like she would just be a very crazy person to like interview. Like I'm not really a Katy Perry fan. Like I listened to a couple of her, couple of her songs back in like, or like early 2010s, but I don't know. I'm, I'm not like a fan. I don't know, but I just, I think from what I've seen, she just seems like such a blast. Like I feel like she would definitely like brighten up the mood. Her or if I had to choose somebody else, um, I feel like, that's, that's, this is like, why did I do this? Why did I do this to myself? I'm like going over my Spotify rap to see if anyone on there is interesting. In my head, at least. I should, I, what if I just interview like Remy from Ratatouille? I think that's pretty iconic. But no, I, I guess, yeah, okay. I, I guess Katy Perry, that's like such a random question. I, we're gonna have to settle on that because I have no idea who else I would do. Millie Bobby Brown would be fun. But I also feel like she's she's also Millie Bobby Brown, so it's a Millie, you know. She, she would just be like pretty average. No hate to her, but I just, you know, it wouldn't be my first pick. That'd be pretty cool though. But yeah, okay, we're gonna have, for some reason, my brain is just going to Katy Perry, so I guess I'm interviewing Katy Perry now. Or, okay, you know what would be really, you know, no, psych, take that back. Love Katy Perry, but switch my answer. Oh! What just happened? Wrong button. I guess I like accidentally hit my keyboard and then we just started like switching screens. I don't know, but um, Jimmy Fallon, like, I don't know. I feel like interviewing, what is an interviewer called? Interviewer, interviewee, I don't know. Just in interviewing somebody who usually does interviews. I would love to interview Jimmy Fallon. Like we, we need just like a change of pace here. 
I think it would be fun. I gotta say my final answer is Jimmy Fallon. Why? I don't know. It just is. Um, either way, let me catch up with chat. Thank you, Bill, by the way, for redeeming first. Congratulations. But how are you? Welcome on in. Hello, Fade. Hello, Vogel. Google Play is downloading an update. Okay. Okay. You do that. Updates. Something about updates just make me mad. It's giving laggy energy. I mean, what am I saying? Wi-Fi. Like, you know, like when you, um, you give your phone, I don't know if Androids do this. I know we have a lot of fellow Android users, but, um, for Apple phones, when you update them, they take like 800 years. They've been a little bit better recently, but especially in the past, Jimmy Christmas, you're just, you gotta go take a shopping trip or something when you, when you gotta download, or I keep saying download, um, update your phone. So that just, it makes me mad because you just physically cannot do anything. You can't stop it once you've like updated it. So you're just stuck. Like with a waiting it's so bad i just hate buffering i hate still wi-fi waiting it's i'm patience for me doesn't exist in case you're wondering so <laughs> you know hello sushi welcome on in how are you doing today how about you don't like you what <laughs> okay okay um that's pretty fair that's pretty fair also thank you for renewing breathe sushi i appreciate it yes today is friday vocal i don't know where you've been at but um it's also march by the way you know <laughs> no it's saturday no, yeah, it's Friday. I don't know. We're never getting everyone mixed up. <laughs> Either way. Also, buffoon is the wildest word you could have chosen for that bill. It's giving British. I don't know about you, but you know. <laughs> um, yeah. Vocal, you're not a grandma. I don't know why you always like refer to yourself as a grandma, but I just gotta say, what the scallop? <laughs> what the rip in your words? I don't think grandmas say what the rip. I have never heard a grandma say what the rip. We should start that. We should have what the rip be like a new thing. That's what I'm saying. But <laughs> Do you have dementia? I mean, guys, what is this? What has this gone to? It's made um, one of the most important decisions of my life. Oh, congratulations. Oh, that's so awesome. I'm so happy for you. I was like, what? I was like, what is the decision? Like looking in chat. Congratulations, so cool. That's a big step. That is, I, I hope that this goes many good ways for you. Hope you meet lots of fun people um, and do good in school, I guess. Don't skip class. That's all I gotta say. <laughs> that's my advice um for sure my brain is a little no agua that is not agua i don't know i said agua what does that mean yes vocal <laughs> yeah i just smile and nod it's like okay let's get you to bed grandma you know <laughs> the new leaf music hits different i love new leaf for sure yeah bill you do i feel like some sometimes you're like due for like a new leaf little like I don't know. I feel, like, I feel like just some days when you have nothing to do, New Leaf is like a really good thing to like whip out of nowhere. You're like, you don't even need to do anything. You can just like walk around. New Leaf is just so good. It's like a blast in the past, but it's not that old. So, you know, bias because my first uh, AC game. Oh, that's fair. That's fair. But, you know, um, bias gets AC and H because it was my first. I know. I wish that like AC and H wasn't people's first, but I'm also kind of happy it was. I think AC and H, for as great as a game as it is, I also feel like you needed to have that build up to it. Like you needed to play some games before you got into like New Horizons because people who like just jump straight into New Horizons were like, this is so slow. This is just not my cup of tea. Like, I don't know what they thought they were getting into. Like this isn't some like fighting and racing, sh like shooting game. Like girl, it's Animal Crossing. Like look into it before you get it. Um, but yeah, I feel like we definitely had some people by some, I mean, um, a lot of people who played Animal Crossing New Horizons who just, um, hated it. You're like, what? Not the hello, Polywog Nintendo. Hello, Bills. No, I said Bills. Bill Bob's 678. <laughs> it is Mario March. I'm so excited for sure. Um, I would interview my bae because she's my world and because she's a celebrity in my heart. Well said, Peachy. Welcome on in. How are you? How are you doing? I love that. I love that, honestly, for sure. No way, because I would interview my bae because the entire world deserves to see her amazingness. <laughs> Guys, what is this? This is wild what is this i feel like i'm interrupting something like should i leave should i just like okay <laughs> you know um that's true that's what i'm saying bill like they do but i guess not i don't like that idea oh okay <laughs> we're having a moment that's what i'm saying like should i should i leave like oh my gosh either way hello fun welcome in how are you doing today um oh nice sounds fun partly cloudy with warmth i wish it was like sunny today good 60 degrees but it's still a little chilly still a little chilly 
but I mean, I'm glad that you got some warmth for sure. But yeah, I'm doing good. We just finished up the Tuesday poll. I'm chatting a little bit before we get into some new horizons on our new um, island. But yeah, I'm glad that you had a little bit of time to chat with some people for sure. Um, play a vlog Nintendo interview special. We should do that. I should like, guys, get you get vocal and peachy in the in the voice chat, and then I just like sit back and it turns into a vocal peachy collab stream, and I'm just um the spectator as are you guys like I become a viewer, and then you guys just interview each other. Hear me out, you know. Like <laughs> either way, Bill, your silly goose needs those to be used more. Like we need to just start using. That scared me. We need to start using that more for sure. Um, literally said, y'all know you do have the ability to inter interview each other right. Like, you could do that if you want. Hear me out. You're on something, though. You know, that's what I'm saying. Um, yeah, I am going to be continuing Retro Hills. I've been making a lot of progress off stream, but I still have a lot of things I need to do, um, on stream. I definitely just, like, in general, even if we run out of things to do. Sorry, um, my hair is falling out, by the way, guys. For no reason at all. Um, but no, I definitely need to like collect nook miles which i have been grinding on for sure it's really fun like actually when you like desperately need nook miles it's really fun to do why did your throat burn what did you are you still sick vocal or do we need to like get you to a doctor <laughs> you know that's like 26 seconds oh well either way stream light for seven seconds that's not that bad could be worse um 2015 was not nine years ago it oh no Side eye. Ew. Why, am, why do I feel like I'm nine years old? Like, I don't know about you guys, but like, sometimes I forget that I'm like not nine years old. Um, that's weird. I'm like, girl, I'm only eight. No, I'm kidding. I'm only, I'm only 74. That's weird. That does not feel right. Bill, you can't come to my stream and just drop things like that and then be like, BRB, you gotta get, get some biscuits. Like, girl, no, you don't. You need to explain to me why you just told me that. Why you just made me think about this the whole weekend now. Mm-mm. This is wild. Okay, either way. Um, oh, you're- Okay, I don't know. I'm an aggressive sneezer. It's more like wheezer. I also feel nauseous before I sneeze and- What? I don't think that's normal, of course. I think you should get that checked out. But I also- I think there's a lot of things we all need to get checked out. Like, why my mouth burns when I eat raw broccoli. Probably an allergy probably like deep like deadly allergic no i don't think i'm like actually allergic to it i don't know why it does that though like i'm fine it's not like i'm like swelling up after i eat it it just burns a little bit you know y'all ever need to sneeze but you can't i know that was me that was me i feel that though because the whole time i was sick i kept having to like sneeze so bad where it was like so uncomfortable like my eyes would swell and my like literal sinuses would just swell up and then nothing would happen and i'm like wow thanks for making me need to blow my nose again for the eighth time it was not fun my no nothing my, no the sneezing ability i have did not like me it just kept like it just kept refilling my like swollen face and then it would be like bye you actually didn't need to sneeze the whole time i'm like you know what that would have solved a lot of things and it lasted for like 20 seconds too of me just like feeling like this dramatic need to sneeze i do it's bad um i have a discord video well i mean not discord video what am i saying a youtube video about that why do you have why do you know that <laughs> Oh my gosh, either way. Yeah, I know. I wish you luck on getting her. I feel like you're, you're, even though you reset a gazillion times, you still got this, you know? <laughs> either way. Um, why does an orange taste no nothing like an orange? Oh, this orange. I was like, an orange tastes nothing like, what is it supposed to taste like then? Like, what does it taste like? Is it just like bitter or something? Bitter fruits actually make me want to sob. Like, you know when you have a fruit salad and it sits for a little too long? I just tasted fruit salad. Um, but yeah, it, it sits for too long and marinates with like, all the other fruits and then tastes like all the same, but it's like really gross, sour feeling. Yeah, but no, that that's also kind of like candy. How if you mix like mint candy and chocolate candy for too long, the mint or the chocolate candy just tastes gross, like minty, gross. I don't know. It's not good. I just marinating cross contaminating flavors is a, a bad thing. No, that would be good, Bill. Like, Elton John, like, I feel like would be a very fun person to interview. But I am curious, why? If you want to share, I know you say, you specifically said, don't ask me why, just, uh, but I am curious as to why you chose that. Cheese puffs? Yes. Like, <laughs> yes. Um, either way. By, oh, okay, that's, by a lot of people, I mean one person, you know, really. Um, either way. Oh, is that, oh my gosh, guys, I'm so... I didn't realize that the whole time. I'm kind of oblivious. Yeah, where did the frog go? That's what I'm saying. 
I didn't actually notice. I didn't notice. Oh my gosh, guys. I'm so oblivious. I just... I'm, like, focusing on chat and, like, way on the side. Not even the one on screen, but, like, the one on the side. I was not even looking at my screen. I'm a little oblivious. You guys have to look at nothing. You have to look at clouds for a little bit of time. <laughs> I'm fine, though. Um... I mean, abusing, no, okay, abusing mod powers part 789 is so real, you know, but that scared me so bad. I, yeah, I literally did not notice. You're like, I don't think she actually noticed. I didn't until you guys were like, guys, what, what, what is she doing? I don't know. This is so bad. This is so, yeah, I did notice Bill. Well, I didn't until I got to this part, but you know, it's been a few minutes. I know. This is so bad. No, that sounds so good though. Like cheese puffs for real. Do Americans say risk it for, no, I say biscuit. Bill, are you, have you not been listening to a word I've been yapping about? Especially, I don't really do it as much anymore, but like in the past, I used to say risk it for the biscuit all the time. I say biscuit. I don't say risk it for a cookie. I don't really know what, like whenever I say risk it for a biscuit, sometimes I forget, is that like from England? Cause I feel like risking it for like a cookie would make more sense, but like risk it for a biscuit sounds better. But I thought they were, they, were, they, they meant like a, like a literal biscuit, like, like an American like roll biscuit i don't know but i was like why like a scone if you if you might put it i don't know why i, I was like why am i risking like, all that effort just for biscuit like that's boring no i think it was intended to be like cookie <laughs> um americana diner with my family last friday on time i ordered oh a fish filet sandwich with garnish coleslaw tomatoes and raw onions tasted it um no really that feels that feel that's pretty that's pretty real honestly Juan. i'm not a big fish supporter I did have tuna noodle casserole the other day. It was not bad. Not bad. But yeah, like a fish filet sandwich. I couldn't tell you how it was supposed to taste. But the raw onions, you know. But I don't know. I, I'm also not a fan of raw onions. Like I know a lot of people like them on their hot dogs and stuff. I don't. Like I don't, I'm not really personally a fan. Also on burgers. I, a lot of people have them on burgers. Like just the barbecue kind of thing. I'm, I'm not familiar with that. But I mean, was it like, what would you rate it at 10? What was your opinion on it? Like overall, you know? Americans using the word biscuit real 20 girl we have the word biscuit we say biscuit it just doesn't, doesn't mean the same thing I say biscuit all the time biscuit you know British websites should ask you to accept their biscuits that's my I that's what I want to invest in where is that like it's not a cookie it's just a biscuit you know biscuits and gravy biscuits and gravy is so good Bill I think you would like it no if you're okay no you said you're a picky eater you would not like biscuits and gravy Biscuit. Okay, Bill. I mean, not Bill. I'm mixing you guys up. My ch I'm mixing my children up. Vocal. I know you're a picky eater, but you you are from the South, and I feel like biscuits and gravy is a very Southern meal. I don't know why, but do you like it? If or if not, what what are which is what are your thoughts on biscuits and gravy in general? Because biscuit biscuit. This is such a weird word. Biscuits and gravy is my life. I look forward to eating it every time that I do. Um, and it's just so delicious. Okay, well, what about what about the biscuits? Like the sausage in the biscuit. That's pretty mild. I feel like this is a pretty default for like a picky eater. The gravy is really good. I think it needs to grow on people though. I think that is one thing is like you need to eat it slowly, kind of get the you know. But um, it's so delicious. Like I biscuits and gravy is like what I think about every day, every second. Every single time I think of breakfast, I'm like, oh, biscuits and gravy. It's so good, and it, it looks really weird. Like there is no doubting that biscuits and gravy looks wild okay people are like you what is that which is fair but like if you actually just try it and like don't even look at what you're eating it's really good but it's it's not i don't know why they call it gravy like that is not gravy it should be like biscuits and sauce or something hashtag not my gravy <laughs> that's the only weird exception to gravy ever like bill you were like that's not gravy when when i showed you that one video that one time it was like a video about like British people. This is such such a long time ago. British people trying biscuits and gravy, and um, yeah, like they were like, "Girl, this is not gravy," and it's not gravy. That's why I don't know why they call it that. Like it is, but it's not. I don't know, but it's so good, you know. <laughs> uh, okay, six point eight. That's not bad, you know. But I mean, I've never had a fish fillet sandwich, so I couldn't really tell you. But I mean, I I'll give it, I'll give it to you for sure, for sure. That's not bad. What do you mean your children? I thought you were a grandma, and neither of us have kids. That's fair. Um, but at the same time, that was part of the family tree. That scared me. Um, that it was part of the family tree that you guys made up. Yeah, vocal the biscuits do slap. Like 
for sure. But I need gravy with mine for sure. Oh, Wobble, dude. Welcome on in. I hope you're having a wonderful, wonderful day. Um, Thank you so much for that reset. I appreciate that. What a great way to, <laughs> to enter. I appreciate that, though. And again, I hope you do have a re wonderful rest of your day as well, for sure. Do I eat uh, plain? Oh, for sure. Yeah, so, Juan, you're I you English. You're a digestive supporter, too. Like, you're, you're a fan of them. I don't blame you, for sure. But oh, iced tea, for sure. You, you got the, the thing going on, for sure. I mean... Especially because you said with Lent, too, you gave up certain types of meals. So, I mean, if those are your solutions, that doesn't sound bad to me. I feel like that's pretty good. Literally tasting the biscuit right now. Your, your mouth, you're foaming at the mouth right now, Bill. That's what I gotta say. <laughs> Either way, um, I have finished with chat. So I, I don't know if that was really a speed run. We're like 35 minutes in. Um, but I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna get Animal Crossing all set up. Um, again, I did play today, so I made a little bit of progress. But we're just gonna jump into what I started. Um... So yeah, give me one moment and I will be right back. ready to go sorry the frog is not working <laughs> all right um this is so super exciting i feel like we haven't played this in forever and it's only been since monday um but i'm so ready to get into it um let me know if game audio needs to adjust it i kind of messed with it over this past couple of days so just let me know what like i need to do to fix it but either way um the villager reveal the villager reveal we're already seeing one and I think you guys are going to be so super excited. Actually, I think you won't be because you guys are very pessimistic, I have to admit. Like, guys, you need to brighten up. But, <laughs> um, if Sheldon just gets his big fat tail out of my face. Okay, there we go. I don't know if she'll turn her head. But her name's Nana. She's a little monkey. And she's bright pink and has little blue ears. Um, there's sh she's just so sweet. She's a normal villager. Um, and I love her to death. She was, like, the second, I think, villager that I hunted on one of my trips to, like, villager hunting. And it was, it was wild. I kind of fell in love with her running. Like, I, I, I contemplated a little bit, I will admit. But, like, I fell in love with her for sure. Um, honestly, you're scared to take your eyes off the bobber. Then don't. I don't know. I'm kind of, like, interrupting her, though. And then, let's see. That's, this is Freckles. We'll go visit Freckles. I already visited her, like, eight times today because she's really cute. But, you know. Um, but let's go and visit her she's i like her house i know it's like basic it's one of the defaults but here's freckles she's fun um she's a peppy by the way either way <laughs> oh you have a pet i'm like scared like yeah guys should we be concerned like i feel like we should be concerned what Guys, I'm so confused. 
So, Freckles, uh, I hope you have a great day. What the flip was that, though? Um, either way. Um, and then, last villager reveal. I think you guys are gonna like them. It's, like, pretty good villager. But, you know. I... I'm working on it, Juan. I'm working on slowly building up my Nick Miles, but it's it's difficult. Oh, this is Rex. He's so super cute. This was an accident. He's a, he's a lazy. He was an accident. He just, like, filled in one of the villager plots by accident. Um, and I didn't realize that I had to, like, hunt ahead of time. I thought it was after for some reason. So, I love him, though. Like, I feel like it was good, for sure. But he's so, so, so super cute. He only moved in today, so he's still unpacking his stuff. But I love him. I think he's definitely worth a shot, for sure. <laughs> either way, let me catch up with chat. I know I missed a little bit, but either way. um, I love that. Perry should have gone home. I don't know if he... I don't remember if he actually did go home, but you know. Phineas is my favorite artist right now, for real. Bill reminds me of Phineas. Mm, yeah. Mm -hmm. Or Ferb, because he's British, you know? Star Kiki was fur, but changed my mind. Star Kiki was like Vanessa. I'm seeing Vanessa. I'm also seeing like Star. No, Star is Perry. I don't know how else to explain it. Star is just Perry the pa Perry. Perry the platypus. Um, you changed my mind on that one. That's what you know. But no, Bill is giving fur personality of Phineas, but the being of fur because of the British. That's what I gotta say. You know. <laughs> Either way. Um. Either Candace or Vanessa, depending on how bipolar I am that day. I see... Okay, you're like a really balanced combination of Candace and Vanessa. But if I had to choose one, I'd have to say, like, Candace. Actually, that's completely a very difficult question. But I see it. I'll say... I'll, I'll, <laughs> I see it, you know? Naming the rival vocal? Okay. Oh, no, I see that. I, I do see that. I do see that as well. Um, I say... Let me see... Whatever, you should do Eeny, Meeny, Mimo. Because, I don't know. I think those are all good, uh, you know. But, yeah, yeah you, I'm gonna let you choose. Because I have no idea. Um, either way. <laughs> Girls in my pants, that song lives rent-free in my head. Rent-free. You know? You do that. You do that, Bill. <laughs> they do. I feel like we need to start hearing those on the radio. Like, petition to get those on the radio. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, Bill. That's that's good, that's good. Oh, yes, call him Phineas. You know, for sure. Like, <laughs> But, Terry, please come home. For sure. Did Bill just call Star a man? I mean, I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. I said that Star was Perry, so I called them an animal. But it's fine. <laughs> Should I get uh, extra Nook Mouse tickets for you if it's okay to work harder? Um, I don't know. I might have to decline. I think I'm going to try to make them myself. But I appreciate the offer for sure, Juan. Um, oh. <laughs> Either way. Bill has bad spelling. I, okay, I'm not gonna lie. Chatting in, like, Twitch is such a hard thing to do. Like, I, that's why I don't view. Because I always mess things up. I've said some wild things where I'm like, oh. My goodness. Like, I did not mean to say that, you know? Oh my gosh. Um, I don't know! I don't watch Phineas and Ferb as much as I should. I feel like I just need to sit down and, like, binge it. Um, it's kind of a really good show. But I don't know. Am I? Oh no, it's like the, the... Um, yeah, 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 that's what it is, Bill. I don't know why I blacked out. I knew it. Yeah, okay. It just came to me in my head. That's what it is. The Doofenshmirtz Evil Incorporated. Yeah. Okay, yeah. <laughs> that's what it is. Either way, um, what was I gonna do? I knew there's something I was gonna do. Oh my gosh. Samson, did I even say hi to you today? Maybe I did. Maybe I did. What's the latest, man? Well, that bridge opens so many more workouts. Yeah, you know. What you doing? Isabella kind of, um, she eats too, but I don't know anyone in chat that's giving Isabella vibes, you know? Vocal the platypus. What an unexpected surprise. Okay. What an unexpected surprise. <laughs> I gotta rat you out for that one. Oh, yeah, for sure, for sure. <laughs> so far, I've been jumping. Oh! The river to train. Okay, girl, what? You do- I don't know what you're- should I, like, delete that bridge? Because what is he talking about? Love the enthusiasm, but okay. Um, I am going to fish. We need to fish. Actually, I think I have fished. Like, we have, like, a couple. I'm trying to think- I know I was, like, in the middle of something before I, like, stopped, um, playing earlier today. Let's- okay, let's just sell what I have now, because I don't know what that's about. 
And then we'll try to make some neck miles to see what is going on with that. And also, I, I will show you guys around. See what's popping and locking, what's going on with everything, you know? No. Yeah, drink drink water. <laughs> drink water. Yeah, that's what I, all I gotta say. Alright, Timmy. Oh my god, I got everything. I bought every single thing in my store today. The customers are crying because I bought them out of house and home. Okay. Oh no, I'm gonna keep this. Um, that looks pretty good. I think I have a lot of- I don't remember why I have so many seashells. I think I was just collecting them for whatever reason. It's been a minute. Actually, it was not that long. Also, why am I getting rations? Give me- give me the bait. Like, no. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we can do. This is a sturgeon that I think- I think these are all, like, really out-of-pocket, um, things that I didn't want to, like, complete, but we're gonna have to, for sure. Hello, Alex. Welcome in. How are you doing today? I have. I think I used to own a pair. I don't know what they were, but I feel like that sound- Like, I know of it, obviously, but I also feel like it's so familiar to the point where I used to own a pair. I don't really know. <laughs> okay, you do that. Bill's already given up. Bill, that's pretty fair. Okay, this is my- I know you guys already probably saw it. This is my front yard, though. My flowers did grow, um, and I have, like, a little log fence around- my house it rained like eight times today so my book is probably ruined that's okay though and then let's do a little house tour it's really small but let's do a little house tour for sure mm, i don't i don't believe so i don't believe so okay i don't wear velcro sketchers love the enthusiasm but you know this is the casa i'm kind of here for it here's my little kitchenette like we have a little tea set this is my little um like pot on the stove oh kk cafe cafe kk whatever it's called I, okay, we need to do a little zoom up. Let's do a little zoom up. I gotta really get in there. Okay. I just had to get this pot because it was 100% giving retro. It's fitting the theme. It's fitting the theme. And then the tea set too. Like, it just... I found that in a balloon though. That was an accident. Um, but I'm loving it. I ordered some things, by the way, in the mail and like Nook Stop that are coming tomorrow. It's like the tape deck and like some green shoes i think so there's a bunch of like green stuff if you can't tell the theme but um this is the house so far i have a typewriter and a phone over here the phone's kind of ugly with the orange but like i'm trying to get used to it let me sit down let me pop squat it's kind of cute sorry let me just rewrite it's giving typewriter. i'm not even typing that's kind of scary that's kind of scary okay <laughs> um here i have i have a stereo i only have one song but i decided i'm gonna use my radio instead it's my little war ro whoa, wardrobe that I changed with. Uh, here's my sturgeon that I caught. Like, woo, you know? Sahara's here today, so I got, like, a little rug from her. I got a wall, too. But she just gave me, like, a... It's like a summit wall or something like that. Girl, it was just mountains. It was not worth it. Um, I have a lot of plants, too. My lantern. And then here's my little bedroom corner. This is where I changed my hair, obviously. And then I also have my shoes that I put at, like, the base of my bed. I, I made some little rubber boots because it was raining today. And then I have my bed, which is so super cute. So I also, I changed the sheets, obviously, to make it green. Because why not? But this is a cute little house. I feel like it's really coming together. Like, I don't know about you guys, but I kind of want to keep it like this forever. That's what I'm saying. But. Ice check. <laughs> I have. I love Ben and Jerry's for sure. I mean, I think their ice cream is good. I don't know about them as a company. But I do like their ice cream. I think it's delicious. <laughs> Mine is, you know give or take some things but also i don't know i think we we did place my, mu my museum whoa on stream and then what else i'll show you my bridge i do, i think i put that down off stream as well i'm trying to like remember it's too difficult though i just put it like right by my house um and it, it was really dumb where i put it like i don't know who let me do this but i put the bridge like in a rent like you can see where it leads just a random piece of land but i couldn't figure out where else to put it i think i here's my thing I think I want this island to be a minimal terraform island. So, like, I might keep a couple parts of the river. Like, I mean, at the top, like, where they connect to the bigger river. And then I might get rid of the other ones. But I definitely want to make it so it's, like, minimal. I might change that, though. Like, I might change my mind um, and make it not like that. But I'll have to see. I have no vision. Like, I have m very few, I should say, visions of how I want my house to look. No, my what am I saying? Whoa. English. Of how I want my island to look. Like, in the end, when I'm done customizing it. But I don't know. I, I don't have any set, like, ideas or plans or goals. Gotta stop and smell the flowers now and then. You know? Running around everywhere. Everywhere will wear you out. Whoa. Everywhere will... Like, that's not a word. Everywhere will... 
I didn't even know you could do that with words. I don't think you can. Maybe you can. Don't you think? Yes, I do. Renee, you're so you're so sweet. I love you. She eats. She gobbles. Okay. Whoops. I know. So I'm saying for sure. <laughs> um, I I just I hope you can get. Are you are you trying to? Oh my gosh. <sighs> Guys, I need to, I need to drink some water or something. I don't know what I'm doing today. Okay. English again. Let me get back in my English mode. Are you resetting today? Or have you given up? Are you taking a break? Either way, whenever you get back into that, I hope you find Cherry because she's sweet and she deserves um, someone like you to have her on their island, you know? But, <laughs> yeah, I, I Ben and Jerry's, they do have really good ice cream for sure. The rival, not the vocal with the accent. <laughs> no, that was really creative. Lovely enthusiasm. Um, okay, Bill, I'm assuming that's really good. So I feel like there's no other thing you should do other than choose that, you know? Like, <laughs> Oh, no. okay, nice, vocal. Then I wish you luck, for sure. I'm tired of uh, looking at these ripping, ripping raccoons. Okay. Honestly, that's pretty real. But, like, at the same time, Timmy and Tommy, I feel bad. Don't bully them, vocal. Be nice. <laughs> okay, I'm just, I want to find a sturgeon, but I only have two places where I can. How many nook miles do I got? What am, what am I working with? Okay. Okay. Also, one of the biggest scams, I think, in the world is one of these options you can get for, like, redeeming things. It's basically spend Nick Miles to get them. So you have to spend 500, at least 500, and you get 200. Mm, that is not girl math. That is hate math. Like, Nintendo hated us when making that. They were giggling, knowing people were going to fall for the trick, thinking that they could get Nick Miles. You're losing it. It's just, you're at a loss. <laughs> I don't know who came up with that, but it's pretty horrendous, if you ask me. You know? Oh my gosh. Um, I still want to say that I believe in you, but if you've been resetting all week, that's pretty wild. That's all I gotta say. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's the vocal with the X for me. I don't know. I don't know. That's, you, Bill's trying to switch things up, but also did not use, it's like, it's like you said so much, but said nothing at all. Like, you did so much, but did nothing at all. Um, also, here's, here's what we got going on. I noticed my second native fruit, so the one that I might find on Duck Mile Islands, are apples, which I did really, really want. So, I'm glad about that. Um, I have some clothes. Lots of green, if you couldn't tell. And fencing. It's pretty boring. Customization kits. Oh my gosh, I have an Ekmo. Let's use it. Like, I don't know why, but like, we're just going to use it. See what we can do. <laughs> Bill. <laughs> Wishing you luck, you know? That's all you gotta say. No, I'm not the Riz Lord. Um, <laughs> all I have to say is don't underestimate vocal. That's all I gotta say. You do this to yourself. You really put vocal in this position and acted like she wasn't going to take you down. That's all I got to say. That's all I had to say. Good luck, Bill. But, <laughs> but other than that, um, we're going to go to the Sigma Island. What are we going to do? No clue. What do we want to do? No clue. <laughs> Let's just go there. I also, I, again, I, I think that's what I wanted to do was go to Harps. That's another thing, so... Let's go to Nook Miles first, and then go to Harps. I'm so happy I get apples, though. I just don't know if I can look up pears ever again. Like, I can, but I think they're a limeland thing. Like, I just don't want to- I didn't want to have anything to do with the pears, but I don't know. Like, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh. Was that bad, then? Yeah, I was gonna say, I think you might have a good Pokemon if it literally went up against all of that. Either way. All right. Let's get going. I feel like there was something I was going to say today, but I literally forgot. Like, sometimes I have things that I, like, hold my head and I'm like, I need to tell stream about that. And then I, like, never do. Okay, we have cherries on this island. That's okay. I'm not looking for anything in particular, but, you know. Didn't go up against all of that. It is all of that. What does that mean? <laughs> Well, I don't know. You're you're speaking in a different language. Love the enthusiasm, though. I have never been to South Korea. I've heard it's really fun, but um, yeah, I've never been out of the country in general. That's one of my goals, though. <laughs> I think it'd be really fun if I could ever do that. All right. I'm so scared. But that was so. Oh my gosh. Oh. Okay. 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 What is happening? 
that was honestly great catch like that's all i gotta say i don't know if you guys can hear my controller vibrating that was insane it was like um that was wild okay but like i got an oarfish so that's pretty wild the that's all i gotta say okay okay nook miles time oh it's right here that was pretty wild i don't know about you guys but that was pretty wild it means i have the broken pokemon i was talking about oh okay okay <laughs> i giggled that's pretty iconic though and we're already like well i don't really i don't know i'm trying to think of the next time i go villager hunting in this game that's what i'm curious about because i want to make sure that i have enough enough miles to get from that runs around because i really want to be sat in stone with my villagers i don't want i don't want to settle for less here guys like i want to be committed but here's my thing it takes a really long time to get nook miles like we'll leave it at that but i don't know when like when my deadline is nor do i want random villagers that fill in places but you know Oh, no, that would be really fun. I don't know. I've, again, I've never been there, so I've never tried that. But you'll have to let me know how it goes if you ever get around to doing that. I'm so scared. Okay. It's so hard because, yeah, again, audio is delayed on my end, so I can't listen to sound and, like, depend on that to catch fish. I just have to see the bobber if it goes down. It's, it's bad. I want to go fishing. I feel like that would be really fun. Like, I have done it before, but I want to do it again. I'm not good at it either. Like, I think I've caught, like, um, one thing in my life, but it's fine. Oh, why did I do that? Psych. Also, I am so mad at this because you guys know that, like, um, Nook Miles Redemption thing I was talking about, how it's, like, you have to catch a certain amount of fish in a row. <laughs> so you have to, like, catch 50 fish in a row without missing one. I did that. And as you can see, I got to 39 and I humbled myself a little too much and I missed one. <laughs> um, was it worth it? No. No. I was just so scared and for some reason my, my brain was just, like, press the button. So I did. And I lost the fish. And I lost my streak. And I just want to cry. But it's fine. These are pretty good fish. I don't know if you get, like, significantly better fish on the Nook Miles Islands. But, um, I mean, they're not bad so far. Like, you know, with the oarfish for starters. <laughs> it's pretty real. But. Hello, Brenda. Welcome in. How are you doing today? I'm kind of just going for all the fish. Like, I feel like little fish... I don't, I don't really know if there's any, like, good little fish. But I'm not gonna hate on them. Okay? We gotta give them a chance. Where am I going? Give, actually, that's a really bad way to look at it. Because I'm, like, giving them a chance to die? Like, for what? No. Well, are they really dead? Oh, okay. Whatever. You missed anyway, so... <laughs> I don't know. I just... Now I feel bad about little fish. Because, like, fishing is just actually... I don't want to go fishing anymore. That's so sad. That's so violent. What? <laughs> what is happening? I just want to play the game. Why don't you give me Cherry? Well, you can always get her later or get the amiibo card. Like, I guess if she's not, like, a starter, it's okay. You know? Um, yeah, I'm glad to hear you're doing good. I'm doing good as well. We're just kind of, um, chill. It's a pretty chill day, uh, on Retro Hills because we... I got a lot done today beforehand and a lot off stream as well. But we're just trying to collect some Nook Miles for now to be able to get some more Nook Miles tickets for next time we go villager hunting. But, you know? gotten the dang unibrow school not hazel we can't hate on hazel peachy has hazel how do you feel about that that you just discriminated one of peachy's villagers yeah no i'm kidding <laughs> but either way she does she does have hazel um started working in my neighborhood nice i nice i know your town still thinking about it still thinking about it it was just gorgeous and i just know this neighborhood is gonna be amazing but once you finish like once you get a little bit more done or even like finish your town i would love to see it again like we need an updated town tour it was amazing. But I'm wishing you luck. I hope that this neighborhood turns out exactly how you imagine. Because that's, like, the best feeling in this game when you can, like, get something to turn out exactly how you imagine it. But I, I wish you luck for sure. That's what I'm saying. You know? With what money? <laughs> okay. Um, then you can go villager hunting later. Just cross your fingers you find her in the campsite. Or go to Nookazon. You can you can buy cherry from Nookazon if you're desperate. I feel like that's not a bad thing to do. Alright. Take take out a loan for Cherry. Honestly, Vocal would. Vocal would do that. Okay, I'm gonna probably actually. I don't think I need to clear my pockets. I don't think I do. No, I'm I'm just gonna keep going. Um, we're gonna go to Harvest now. Um, and I guess just see like what's going on over there because I never went there. I I talked to Harv. Um on my island but i never actually went to his when he was telling me about it so we're gonna have to get that out of the way for sure build a shopping district through the tunnels 
and nothing behind the neighborhood. I, for sure. I mean, that's true. But, I mean, I'm glad you're making some progress for sure. Boo. Oh, my gosh. I think I choked. I think I choked a little bit. That look just looks weird now when it shouldn't, and I really hate that it does. I really hate that your name looks weird. War is over. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I like it, though. Don't switch it back. The purple. Okay, that's, like, so weird, though. Oh, I was like, what? he is like, where is he going to take me if he has no idea what I'm talking about? <laughs> I know. I forgot that you even changed it. I just, I kind of just blocked it out. I, it was too traumatizing of a switch. The change was too... Okay. Okay, that's fine. You do you. Nature is healing. Nature is now broken again. The storms are coming, you know? Rip my life. No, Bogle, No. What is happening? I don't even know. But like, Bill, um, that's pretty wild. You know. Oh, I was like. <gasps> oh, I don't know what happened. That's okay. That's okay. You're good. Sorry, my microphone's peeking. You're good. I, I am just trying to process so much right now. I don't know what's happening. You're good though, Peachy. You're good. <laughs> I was like, someone, so, I just saw somebody deleted 70 messages, and I was like, oh my gosh, like, what happened? What did I miss? And then I see Peachy timed out Bill for, like, one second. I was like, what? Okay. I don't know. Like, change it back to purple, or else I'll do it again. Oh my gosh. It's giving the time Bill banned vocal from the server. It's giving the one time every single one of vocal's messages got deleted. It's giving that time this, oh, oh. What is that? What is that? I just... Ugh. Where is the entrance to... That looks just weird. I don't like the way that looks. I feel like this never existed before. Where... Where's the opening to the other... Like, I know I don't have it yet, but like... What? It just... What? Ew. I'm just gonna start throwing up. <laughs> I killed it. No, Bill. Bill. I know. I know, it just- it just looks weird, though. Like, I haven't seen this in so long. Kind of tummy-turning, if you ask me. All right, Harv, what's going on, you know? Hey, it's you. Hey, so I'm getting a feeling he- Yeah, I was gonna say, I'm getting a feeling he forgot my name. That's pretty common, though. It's fine, you know? Why do I talk like that? Why do I just become American? That's fine. You made it out to my island. Thanks for coming, um- Holly, bro, was like, mm, yeah, I bet you got it wrong. He was like, thanks for coming, Susie. Like, uh, thanks. I don't, okay, guys, I need a question. I need to ask you a question. What's more hurtful? Somebody just completely forgetting your name and asking you, like, what was your name again? Or somebody who calls you the wrong name? Who's, like, dead serious, like, they think that's your name. Like, they don't remember, like, remember. Um, I think, personally, I don't know. It depends on how close the other name is, you know? I've had people call me wild things, and I'm like, um, yeah, so wait, this, what is that? That's not even a name. But I've also had a lot of people forget my name. But it was, like, weird. Like, why? I don't know. It's a whole story. That's for another day. That's for another day, you know? Either way. Um. <laughs> no. Like, potty. That one was pretty wild. That one was pretty wild. Um. Oh my gosh. Okay, Bill, you can't do that. Curse mode was actually way harder than I thought it was gonna be. Not gonna lie, I just sounded like I was weird. Like, I don't even know how to explain it. No, we can't have a Jennifer Coolidge mode. Um, love the enthusiasm, but that's gonna give me some weird looks, okay? Only Jennifer Coolidge can do that. If I did that, um, I would get banned. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. Star can do a really good Jennifer Coolidge impression. It's kind of scary, um, but I can't. Star can also do a relatively good australian accent if anybody cares i cannot what is a vocal mode that's just yeehaw mode we already have that <laughs> no but like what is what are, you, what are you defining as a vocal mode can we have a bill mode that's just british mode that's just bill saying i can't even say what bill says i have seen what bill says and it's very scary it's something i cannot repeat on the channel <laughs> you know sure good is sure sh wow it sure is good to see you again polly yes sir good old polly bro is trying so i remember my name Anyway, welcome to Harvest Island. Don't remember if I mentioned it before, but I run a photo studio here. It's called Phototopia. Photo... Photopia? What? No, it's not. 
Ophotopia? Is that what it is? Why have I never actually read what that word was? I thought it was phototopia. Bill, I don't like you. The timer's starting. Well, I'm speaking. It doesn't even start yet. The timer's starting now. Wow. But okay, I, I thought it was like phototopia, but it's like photopia? Or I guess that's what it's called. Either way. Because it's like paradise for picture taken. And it's free to all. So come use it anytime. Okay. So what else did you want me to do? I feel, I feel like there was like more I should be doing. But it's fine. Let me fix uh, the gameplay real quick. Okay. Once again, we need a capture card that does not do this. I don't know why it does that, though. If I, like, don't touch it for a long time or just sit, then when I try to play it next, it just gets really whack. And I can't play, like, the game on time with audio or gameplay. It just gets delayed. It's really weird. Um, personally, I know you have a very light southern accent, though. It, you said it only comes out when you get mad, apparently. So, um, I've never seen you mad, unfortunately. Actually, fortunately, I've never seen you mad. So, um, I don't know. But, I mean... I'm aware that I'm not getting your twang rot, but I mean, it's just a really stereotypical bad southern accent done by somebody who has never been to the south before. Photosynthesis. I love photosynthesis, guys. We need to talk about photosynthesis more um, because plants are very interesting. I will admit. Um, but you know, I, I guess that we're done with that. That was way quicker than I thought it was going to be. Who wants to come over to my island? I feel like we have way too much time to spare. We Okay, like an hour. But I also need to friend some of y'all on this account. Oh my gosh, I just said y'all. Ew, that just came out too naturally. Okay, but I do need to friend some of y'all on this account. So let's do that. I feel like if anyone wants to come over, you know? I'm, I'm curious. Okay, so Roald and Agnes. Um, stopping there and getting Cherry later. Okay, Roald and Agnes aren't bad though. Like I feel like those are pretty good villagers for sure. So I, like, Cherry will come along. I think she'll fit in just fine. I think, you know... Just wait, like, for the right moment. Maybe it's just not the right time. You never know. <laughs> I'm bringing you home soon, you know? Um, I mean, it's giving, it's given that one time when I accidentally killed a Psyduck right off the bat because I didn't realize that I could kill it. And I did. So, RRP Psyduck, you'll be loved. The first Pokemon I've ever killed in Violet. Am I proud? No. Would I do it again? No. Did I cry? Yes. No, I didn't. Mentally, I did, though. It's fine, though. Either way. Um, but yeah, if anyone wants to come over to my island, like, let me know at all my gates. <laughs> Either way. I would say... Well, why would... Why would just throwing a Pokeball, like, kill it? It doesn't feel right. Okay. Good luck, Bill. I wish you luck. Okay. Also, guys, I need to know. Now that 2023 is wrapped up, I was asked this question. I need to ask you guys this question. Um, I feel like I'm going to know most of your guys' answers. Maybe I won't, though. But out of the movies that just came out in 2023, not like in general, but just of the ones that came out in 2023, what are your or what was your one favorite movie that you saw in 2023? I'd have to say for me, um, it's kind of a tie between, like, Barbie and Mario, but I have to say Mario because I waited a lot longer than that one. I still haven't seen that vocal, and I'm really mad. It, my accent's giving... Lucy Gray. No, I'm kidding. But um, I still haven't seen that and I'm really mad at myself. I feel like I definitely need to. Um, but I've heard such great things about it for sure. I've read Oh no, no, I okay, sorry. <laughs> um, I did get the book. I, I I was also holding back on watching it. Like I was gonna just jump through like the last book and then jump straight into the movie. Like I would I wasn't gonna read them like I did for the other first three movies or first four technically. Um, but here's my thing. I finally, like, because that when that movie was coming out and the book was really popular, I couldn't find it anywhere. But I finally got it on my library. So super excited. So I, I picked up the book. And I have, like, two, well, like, two, one and a half weeks or something like that to finish it. So when I finish it, I'm probably going to watch it. And I might have to wait for it to be on streaming services because I don't know if it's in theaters anymore, which is my problem. But I've heard really good things. And I definitely want to read the book first just to say that I have before I jump into the movie. Because I also think those movies, like, Hunger Games are really hard to understand if you don't. If you haven't read the book, like, you don't know what's happening and you're just watching the movie for the first time. But, yeah, I will say I got the book, so I should be watching that, like, relatively soon. My book expires March 11th. Like, I can also renew it, too, but I don't really like doing that with books. It's just getting procrastinating, you know? <laughs> Oops, I don't know why I did that. Anyway. Barbie, I, I know. Barbie was a really good movie, too. That's why I put it, like, second place. But, um, I feel like you just, if, to, in order to like that movie, you had to be, like, I don't know. You had to just, un like, those who get it, get it. Those who don't, don't. Like, I know, Bill, you watched it. You said it was just okay. But 
I feel like you have to, you have to just understand. Like, it's, <laughs> I'm not going to explain it, but Barbie, like, when you really dig deep into it and understand and have lived part of it, like, it just makes sense, you know? Um, but I thought it was a great movie overall. Still have not seen Oppenheimer. Don't want to, though. I'm good. <laughs> but, what is happening? Okay, so, me when my timer went off, but nothing happened. It's my, like, I didn't know what happened. Either way. I still have, like, the accent. <laughs> my timer went up, so I don't have to speak country. I always just say it's country. I don't really know what else you're supposed to call it. Why is it sticking? Like, I feel like I'm, like, holding back. Oh, here, let's let's talk to Nana. She's a cutie patootie. She is the cutest in the world. So good, unexpectedly. It's so good to unexpectedly bump into a friend. Also, she calls me Popo. It's it's giving Polly. It's giving Polly Wong Nintendo. It's giving Popo. It's giving police, you know? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, to be honest. Um but it died you know it's it's fine bill bill's ty after typing the triple a batteries you know <laughs> i'm kidding um but yeah bill we cannot watch that um love you but we can't watch <laughs> not in a family friendly community and you can watch that on your own time though <laughs> um i'm definitely going to just kind of as time goes on get like some items like that um i have a lot that i'm thinking of already that i've that I know of because of, like, oh, Lineland, I don't know why the name wasn't coming to me, because of Lineland, because I've seen a lot of furniture items that I think would fit that category, um, but I'm, I'm slowly, so I definitely need to get more, but I mean, I will be upgrading Nook's Cranny soon, I don't know when, I think it's kind of gonna be on, like, my own time, like, I don't really know, I think you have to, like, I think if I'm correct, spend $30,000 or bells on things in the store to upgrade it. And I don't know how many I've actually spent already, but quite, quite a lot. So, um, eventually I will. I think I'm pretty close at this rate, but yeah, I'm, I'm going to be definitely getting a lot of fun retro items from my next cranny. Um, when does it get upgraded? So I'm excited about that, but, uh, are Jack in the, sh Jack in the box chick, ch whoa, chicken strips good. Um, I don't know. If, I think I had them once. I don't think they were bad. I think they were pretty good. I think Vocal is the worst person to ask for that because Vocal isn't like anything. Um, no offense to you, Vocal. Love you. But I think they're good. I'd say they are. I don't really remember. I'm definitely, um, a chicken nugget slash... I just like chicken. Like I guess I'm, I just, I eat like a picky eater, but I just adore chicken. So, um, chicken, tiny tacos with like the avocado, creamy, lime, zesty sauce. I don't know what it's called. And then, um, curly fries are better than regular fries, personally. And a taco or two. That sounds so wild. Not all in the same time. Sometimes, no, actually, that's a lie. Sometimes it's, like, some tiny tacos and chicken nuggets. Most of the time, that's just things I order in general from Jack in the Box if I ever go. But, no, that, if I ate all of that in one sitting, that would be pretty wild. Like, 15 tiny tacos, 10 chicken nuggets, and, like, a taco or two. Like, that's wild. But, no, and, like, just in general, I order those things when I go. Um, but I'd say the chicken strips are pretty good. <laughs> I'm a picky eater. It's like, it's giving like, this is not a banger. And I know bangers. I know bangers. It's giving you a chicken strips. Actually, I will give that to you. That That's pretty fair. Local is probably the best person to ask for that. But from my experience of like years ago, trying the chicken tenders one time, clearly they weren't good enough if I didn't get them again. But I don't remember at all what they taste like. I don't think they were bad though. Some chicken strips. Okay, vocal, in my opinion. What am I saying? I need to show my shop. In your opinion, what is the what are the worst chicken strips you've ever had from any place? I think I've asked you that before, but I need a refresher because I have short-term memory loss. But I am very curious as to like what's the worst you've had. For me, I think Harl's Jr. slash Hardy's, I think it's called two, it's called two different things in two different places. Um, just to, like just horrendous horrendous. I don't know what they do to their chicken. It's giving trigger warning for gross description. It's giving if somebody chewed up a piece of chicken and then spit it back out and then like covered it in breading. Like, I don't know what they did to that, but it's just so scary. No. Oh, oh, take, I was like, I think you said take that back from me. And I was like, Han, have you gone to Hardy slash Carl Jr.? Like, it's so bad. Anyway. Um, oh, I don't think I've ever been there before. Is that a South Southern place? No, you take that back. You take that back. Sonic actually has really good chicken tenders. And I will be sitting by that. No, they're not. Did you put ketchup on them or are you eating them plain? Vocal, if you don't like ketchup. If you don't like ranch. If you're not normal. That's how you find out. 
hear me out no because like it's sonic is like really good it's very expensive for no reason though like you're kidding but like it's delectable either way <laughs> also she is such a hopeless romantic nana love her but like she has talked to me about wanting to be in a relationship 800 times and vicariously living through books and movies do we support? Yes. But also, like, girl, what? Why did none of my other, like, normal villagers do this? I feel like this is, like, so... Like, Chevra, Fauna, and Bertha have never talked about these things before. It's just a Nana thing, you know? But the romance novel I'm reading has me imagining the ideal date. It might be nicest to get outside together. Do something like picking fresh cherries. No, that would be iconic. That would be really good. Good, A good first date. Or, like, like a picnic. Picnic, I feel like you also can't mess with. I mean, it's just... It's good. Uh, a good chicken strip shouldn't need ketchup, um, not to be dry. No, any chicken, I think, should- any meat, if it's meat, it should have ketchup on it, in my opinion. And by ketchup, I mean a half a bottle on one bite. So, that's my- that's how I live, um, in case you care. So, anything can be enhanced from ketchup. I had lemon chicken the other day. Really good. But I also do think that it was better with ketchup. It, it just enhances the flavors and i also only taste ketchup so therefore it's good well, i am really far back let's let's move forward hopefully it doesn't fall in the river oh my gosh i hate when that happens it makes me like it makes my heart stop i'm like <gasps> you know we just barely made it okay okay i'm fine i'm fine <laughs> monster oh what's this one is this a better one oh okay my, my other one had like a blue pot that one's not bad. Let's go back. I have a couple red accents, especially in my kitchen, that I think we can, like, pair this with. Let's go back. Uh, me when I didn't use the bridge and I just used my vaulting pole. That was so useless. Why did I do that? Either way. Going back inside. Let's see if this red potted, like, monster looks better than the blue one. The blue one's not bad. But I just, I'm just seeing. Maybe it'll be, like, the most horrendous thing I've ever seen and then I'm gonna cry. Also, because the, okay, the blue one does match that, like, dotted rug that i have let's just see okay that one's not bad i gotta really take it in gotta really like see what's going on okay that was not bad that was not bad let's see this one now okay i might go with red like i don't know why but i'm i might go with red you know you're like no <laughs> i actually hated every second of it that's pretty fair mine's the most centered you can get it so i'm i'm very happy with mine i hope you get a centered one back to the grind good luck vocal i like feel so much empathy for you but i've also never done them before so i don't know how but i just i know how you feel in some way shape or form okay let's go sell some things i'm i really want to make some money too so i can uh, upgrade my house right now i need Mm, like 25,000 more? It's not that much. It's not a crazy amount. And I already have 100,000 in my savings, by the way. So, like, yeah, 25,000, easy peasy. It'll be very easy. So, I think we're going to work on that next. We got this, though. This is like Cormora. Oh, yeah. But shoot, that's what I'm saying. That was insane. But also, the dedication was pretty real. Like, I, I would do that if I had the Nook Miles. I, here's my thing. And I will literally cry about this until the day that I die. So, you know when you're really desperate for things and um, you just do anything you can to get them? I'm pretty sure you know that feeling. For some reason, I think I was, like, upgrading to one of the final um, stages of my house. And I don't know why. But I was so desperate for money. Like, I couldn't just make it myself. So, I bought, like hundreds basically of bevel vouchers from my abd to get money easily i want you guys in chat to take a good guess at how many nook miles i had or aka spent on these bell vouchers and i have never from that moment i have never had i I've, I've been stuck in like nook miles debt it, I, it's a wild amount by the way guys but yeah i've only ever had like a couple thousand at most from that point and i've not been able to recover i don't know what i did to get that many nook miles in the beginning but i don't know why i spent them higher peachy go higher <laughs> think bigger that's what i'm saying you know okay we're really close i need like no actually maybe i need a lot more maybe i need twenty thousand now no it's like whatever a couple 
No, keep going higher, Peachy. <laughs> keep going higher, you know? It's scary. Just think, think it's horrific. It's scary. All right, I'm gonna go oh, back on the hunt for a sturgeon because those sell for a lot. I don't know if I'll find another ore fish. That's kind of risky. Higher, <laughs> higher. It's pretty, it, it gets intense. Just keep going. I don't know why I did this. It took me so long, though. An afternoon was spent. Oh, what are you thinking about, hon? An afternoon was spent, though, redeeming battle voucher after battle voucher. Did I get my house paid off? Yes. Was it worth it? No. Should I have made the money myself? Yes, you know? Higher. I'll just tell you, because you are pretty close. It was, like, 130k. 130k nook miles. I still have no clue how I got those. We're, I don't even remember making them. I think they just appeared one day. I swear to gosh, diddly darn. Like, it was wild. And I spent every single one of those on bell vouchers. Like, why? Just make your money, woman. Don't cheat your way through the system. But yeah, I had 130k nook miles that I spent to get bells, which are so much easier to get. Oh, another lantern? Okay. Maybe it's green. Maybe it's green. Or maybe it's like yellow or something ugly. We'll see. You don't have to keep it if you don't want. That scared me. That scared me so bad. Voice chat, uh, you know. A scary voice chat incident. Let's see what this lantern looks like, though. Why do I still have two items? It, it is green. I don't have a green one. I have a blue one, I think. Oh, Renee gives Renee a big kiss on the schnoz. Honestly, she was too real for that. It's like she knows. It's like I'm not decked out in green every two seconds. Or like I am decked out in green every two seconds. That's pretty wild. Come on. Okay, I don't like you. Actually, you're a bad fish. Okay, let me see what else I can do for Nook Miles. I can plant some stuff. I don't want to spend bowels. It's kind of annoying. What? Let's see what the hot item is. Because the hot item actually might give me some bowels too. Depending on how good it is. L last time it was like a stone stool. Girl, I got like 800 for it. It was not that good. Um, Let's see. Oh, bonfire. Oh, that's actually kind of hard. Because I have to like literally make like wood. Or use wood to make it. Let's see. Oh, 10 wood oh my gosh no pay me the wood first the wood just normal wood is like actually impossible to get in your horizons and i think we need to talk about that more well i'll see that's the only game you can get it in okay let's go put this lantern in my house though before i forget so far though for trees that are not my native fruit that i planted i've planted coconuts um oranges and apples so that's pretty iconic if you ask me but still waiting for um other fruits. I don't really know how else I can get them. Maybe Cap'n's Island when I get to that point. I'm not too sure though. Aw, little green. Is that the is that the same color? Maybe I already had a green one. No, that was blue. That was blue. Yeah, that's not the same color. Perfect. Also, I'm I'm looking for a new wall. Like this one's not bad. Kind of ties everything together. Make sure like the walls aren't drawing away from the whole site. But I am like continuously checking back into next cranny to see if I can find anything. And it's so bad every single time. Even Sahara can't help. She gave me a, like, summit wall. What is a summit wall? It was just, like, smoky mountains. Like, hun, what? Give me something good. I'm passing up that little fish. We petition for that fish to live forever, you know? Like a magic fish. What was that one, like, rainbow fish book? That carried. Nobody talks about that enough. I can, like, taste that book, and I don't know why. Like, I promise I don't eat books. But for some reason, you, you know when you, when you just, like, taste the way some, Like, I don't know. Maybe I'm just, like, insane. You, like, taste the way something smells. I just, like, remember that book had, like, a very distinct smell. Like, kind of like a new book smell, but it, like, always smelled like that. I don't know how to explain it. It just, it just, gas smile and not ugh, squid. I get so mad when I find them, because they're just, like, basic. No discrimination, but, like, they, they're just not good. They need to get good. All right. Um, let's see. No fish, unless they're like minuscule. Don't really want to invest in those. Um, let's see. Freckles has been in her house all day. I feel like she's not okay, but I've also checked in on her like too many times and she's fine. So like, I don't know why she's like avoiding me, but it's fine. Like you do you, I guess. Okay, so no fish over here. That's cute. Let's see if we can find any over here. Also, I I uploaded my um four hour <laughs> my four hour stream before stream today, and I just know that bad boy is gonna take a minute to upload. That's okay though. 
That was a really fun stream. That was really fun. I want to do that again for sure. Um. Also, something that I find is so funny is like how whenever I'm like live for whatever reason, like usually for like a test stream or something, and people see that I'm live, they just they I they appear faster than anything I've ever seen before. Like I don't know why or what the like science is behind that. Um, but why whenever I go live when I'm not usually live, does everybody rush in here? And they're like, what's going on? You know, I'm like, um, what? It's very weird. But I also love the enthusiasm, guys. Like, <laughs> you know. So maybe, what if I just did a four-hour stream, but I didn't tell you at all until one day I just went live and then everyone just, like, joins? I don't know. We'd have to find out. <laughs> but, no, I'm so excited for my town tour of Limeland, though, in, um... I think I okay. I don't. I haven't really decided the official day I'm gonna do it. Around March 20th, though, kind of like Animal Crossing's or ACNH's like fourth anniversary. Around then, um, I'm gonna do the town tour. But I'm not gonna do it like I did last. That was a really rough town tour. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. Could have been better. But I think I'm gonna do it kind of in a more like aesthetic kind of ambiance way. I don't know what that even means. Um, well, you know what it means. I don't know how I'm making sense of that. But like. I want to do it in like a oh cinematic way. That's what I'm kind of thinking of. Cinematic, kind of like how I do or how I format my like typical videos, but then with you know like a t town. I don't know, like in a town tour way. And I'll have like captions maybe instead of like me speaking. I just want it to be fun. But I think it'll be, it'll turn out really cute, especially for all the work that I put into that goofy town. Um, it needs to pay off in some way. Oh, that yeah. Oh, no, I, okay, I don't know. I just said ambiance, although that was not the word I was thinking of. I was thinking more of, like, cinematic. But I don't know how I got either of those words confused. <laughs> it just happened. All right, um, I'm just collecting cherries right now. I feel like I can get a little bit of money for those. I don't have enough, like, not... Actually, that's a lie. I have a lot of um, apples I can sell, but I want to hold on to those for now. So I'm just going to collect cherries since those will grow back for sure. Um, let's go over here, actually. Also, I love that little emote for sure. That little bamboo shoot. Is that that was from the hype train, right? If I'm correct. I'm not too sure. I was there for the hype train. I don't know. Wait, no. Let's see. If I got the hype train, I don't know if I can see it from over here. My email. Oh yeah, here we go. Okay, it was. It, I do have it. I don't know why it's from 2020, but I do have it. Look at how cute th those are. Little bamboo like sparklers. <laughs> All right. So I'm not really seeing any more cherry trees. Oh no, I lied. It's fine. <laughs> you know. Okay. Um, let's go back up to the cliffs. Also, I'm so sad because tomorrow's the last day I can listen to the prologue music. Because then my town hall will be built. And then I'll have the hourly music. Which is, like, sad. But we also got, we got to progress. Like, you know, I can't stay here forever. But I'm, I'm excited. So super excited. I, I still... Here's my thing. As I mentioned before, like, I don't really have any set ideas for my island. Like, I'm just kind of, like let it roll and then see how it goes from there i don't know like i, I like i have ideas i might make a pinterest board that is um until i can use social media again whatever it's fine though <laughs> it's fine pinterest is just too uh entertaining but i i'm i'm probably gonna make some kind of like vision board type thing before i start my island so i get some ideas of things that i definitely want to do because i have a lot of ideas there's a lot of things on my current like limeland town that i really wanted to do but never got around to it because i didn't want to mess with the theme but now that i have like a whole new town i have so many ideas like my head is just exploding with ideas so that's where we're at with that but also it's it's one of those things where i just don't know where to start like customizing an animal crossing especially without like a guide or any kind of reference is very difficult for me <laughs> so i'm hoping eventually i can do that but renee are you sweeping um the grass you have a little br yeah you got a little broom what okay you do you you do you love the enthusiasm <laughs> you're like i just i need to do something else i need to do something new because this is just too much that's fair that's fair but i hope it ends soon because you know i just i can sense cherry she's she's go she's close you know, I, but I don't know when. Like, that's my thing. Oh, 5,000 bells. Nice. That's gonna help me out. All right, let's go sell these cherries, though. Me too, PG. It's just one of those, like, Friday things, I guess, you know? What was the highlight of your guys' day, though? For me? Animal Crossing. Stream, you know? Like, that's all I got. I don't know. It was a pretty chill day. Um, but I think Animal Crossing, playing Animal Crossing and playing a stream was definitely worth it, for sure. <laughs>
going home yes we respect we support <laughs> i know when it's like it's giving like when people are asked like what their what their favorite class is in school and everyone just says lunch or like recess that's pretty pretty real you know going home i feel that all right um okay it's not a lot it's not a lot but i need to get somewhere okay we need like not that much more guys what if I just... Fine. Fine! I'll make it easier and I'll buy a couple... Oh, not buy. Sell a couple stacks of apples. Because I have a lot. You know? Okay, Hazel is just... Maybe it's like a sign. Maybe we need to stick with Hazel. Peach, you need to pep talk vocal into like sticking with Hazel. Because she does not like Hazel. I don't know. Also, we got enough money. Or... I, can't, I am mixing up currencies. Nook Miles for another ticket. So that's fun. No Hazel. <laughs> um... No, I think we need Hazel. Hazel, she's she's a good villager. I do like her a lot. I don't know. You do you, but I feel like you're missing out. You're missing the big picture over here, you know? Ice check. I didn't really put that much, like, ice in my water. But it's being a little dramatic. Um, I'm gonna do, like... Mm, hmm. Fine. I feel like I don't need that much, but we're going to, I guess a little, I'd rather not be like poor after this. So we'll just sell like four, I think is what I did. Four stacks of apples. As long as I have 10, I'll be okay. And I'm also, I also planted like one or two apple trees, um, I believe. And so I should have more growing, so it'll be okay. But I used to be convinced in the older games, I don't know if this is actually true and I'm pretty sure it's not, but I was convinced that if you like shook apple trees, not apple trees, fruit trees that had fruit on them that weren't originally from your island they would like not grow back but apparently that's not true so i think i just made that up either way um i'm gonna sew i have some apples guys apples <laughs> it's giving i ordered an apple and they gave me two chips i think about that all the time like who what is that that's my question either way how much am i gonna get oh the microphone peak do I need that much? No. Am I going to get that much? That's a lot. That's actually kind of crazy. Okay, well, I'm not going to be poor after that. That's for, you know, a fact. I'll have like 14000 I think. Either way, I'm going to pay off my loan. That's kind of wild. That's kind of wild. Actually, oh my gosh. <gasps> oh. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what, what I'm gasping so aggressively about, but, um. <laughs> I Oh. Oh my gosh, Nana. She's just like squatting down by Freckles' house. Like, okay. <laughs> Okay, why is, like, plurals, um, so weird? Like, plural words, like, freckle, it's, like, freckles house, I guess is how you say it, or, like, I, it wouldn't be, like, freckles this house, like, that's dumb. Freckles house? I don't know. I give up. English is just too hard. I'm just gonna move to a different, uh, language for my, for my language that I use, that I speak, that I use, that I speak with, because English is just getting too out of hand for me. Okay, we're gonna put, um, 98,000, no into my savings oh okay that that works <laughs> that works too and then we're gonna pay off the loan pay from savings okay oh okay we'll get there this is wild guys we just paid off my house yeah yeah tom like after like sipping some like pop or something what is he, he looks like he's like oh, okay you know what <laughs> it's fine i'm gonna take out my money again i put like all my all my money that i've ever owned in this bank account so let's take that out see i said i was gonna have fourteen thousand guys you just don't trust me well you never disagreed but you know like <laughs> you know okay tom nook tommy boy i don't know why i just call him like really weird things and i might well hello there polly congratulations you are the proud owner of a luxurious size but that's not luxurious L oh no Luxur- 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 I don't know. Why am I- What is that word? Suddenly my brain is spasming. Oh, luxuriously? I don't know why my brain just like was like, stop. Forget- Um- Oh! Moko, really? Really? Did you actually get her? Did you get- Did you get Cherry? I just threw my controller. I hope it's not broken. Did you actually get you Like, don't do this. Don't let me hanging. Chat delay. Keep up. Keep up, you know? 
Also, I want to, I want to spread cranberry too. I have not had that since the holidays and it, every, like I only got it one time and once it ran out and never restocked. She's home. <sighs> Honestly, um, I'm so happy. I don't know why I like jumped. I don't know why, um, I literally sat straight up. My posture fixed. Okay. That was wild. But like, um, nice. I, I told you vocal, like I sensed it. I sensed it. Okay, after I said that I sensed that Cherry was close, how many times did you have to reset for, for her to, like, appear? Because I need to know how true that was. I, I did sense that she was close. But, like, preach? You better stick with this island. You better stick with this island. I don't think you want to do that again, you know? Um, um, well, okay, it'll still be... I think it's just the theme of it that's going to be, like, retro. But, um, I think... No, yeah, I'll, I'll still play normally. It's just more the theme. I'm not going to be too authentic with it, but you know, um, either way, that's okay. Billy, uh, let me see. Who is Billy again? I think I know exactly. No, maybe that's Kid I'm thinking of. I don't know. Billy, ACNH. Oh, okay. Okay. He's a little suspicious, but you can always kick him out. Don't worry. You can always kick him out. Why did I also just, I didn't realize you said the same thing too. Yeah, you can, you can kick him off. Oh, three resets? Okay, that's not too bad. Three, like, one, two, three strikes, you're out, but also you're in. Like, that was not even the saying, because... What am I saying? Um, but okay, like, whoa, you're like, Cherry came home! <laughs> that scared me so bad, like, I didn't know what to do with myself. Congratulations, though, vocal. I'm glad, but yeah, I mean, as long as... Who was the other villager you were wanting to get before? Because it was Cherry and somebody else. You wanted to get them both at the same time, which we were like, um, that's gonna be a little hard, but... I don't know. At least you got Cherry, like, that's all that matters. Oh, Teddy. Okay. Okay. Um, either way. <laughs> Can't imagine the feeling of satisfaction you must have. Truly, what could be better, hmm? Well, I suppose you could have another room. That might technically be considered, or be considered better. <laughs> oh, don't mind me. I simply can't help myself. But do come see me if you have, okay. I, you have piqued my interest. So let's see what's going on. Oh, Polly, hello, hello. What would you like to talk to me about? I'm all ears. Um, about my home. Kind of on another room, you know? For your home, I think adding a new room would be nice. If we add it on the back, it won't change the look of your home, but you'll get so much more space. It'll also keep the construction costs down, relatively speaking. This will require taking... Why are we jumping? That was a big jump in money, okay? This will require taking out a loan for... 348,000 bells. What do you think? Do you want to proceed? Let's do it. I wonder if with the prologue in mind, like before you even get resident services, how um, far can you get to paying off your house? Like, can people actually pay off the entire loan before you get town hall? Or within the first week, at least. I feel like you can if you really, really grind. I'm already like at my third expansion. Well, I paid it off, got it expanded once. This, yeah, this is my third expansion. Um, I don't know how many. There's a lot, though. I think there's a lot, you know? Um, but yeah, no worries, Juan. Sounds good. Sounds good. Excellent. I'll get the construction started right away. Everything should be ready for you to by tomorrow morning. So exciting. Exciting indeed. Am I just going to keep my hot, my roof color the same? I, am, I, I really, really want to, um, like have my house fully upgraded mainly for like the exterior design like that's kind of where i'm going for sure um it's gonna be an extra room in the back so he's adding on a room to the back so it'll give me like a designated like bedroom or extra room um and it won't it'll only be one size i think for all the rooms you only have one size it was so annoying i didn't get that far in new leaf with the can you guys hear that Can you hear that? No. No, 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 no. Okay, it's... By the way, if you can't... I don't know if you can't hear it. But if you can't hear it, um, KK Parade is playing on my radio. That was the most traumatizing experience I've ever experienced. That song haunts me. It shouldn't be scary, but it's also the most horrific song I've ever heard in my life. And it just... It gives me goosebumps. It makes me feel so afraid that I can't speak. That scared me. That was not a great way to walk into my house. But, um, I think it's the biggest that my living room will get. It wasn't, what I was saying though before, is like, it's annoying because a new leaf, every room that you had, you would upgrade 
fully. But in New Horizons, you just pay for one of the rooms and they give it to you. Like, you don't need to do any further expanding. Like, you just get it as it is and you can't change it from there. But yeah, for New Leaf, you'd, you'd buy a room for, like, the smallest it can be. And then you'd upgrade it again. And you could choose to either add a new room or expand the room that you just bought. It was so bad. You had to expand it, like, two or three times for it to be its full length. And that was a lot of payments. I'll just tell you that. Like, the final payment was so insane where you're like, oh, my goodness gracious. Um, but I'm so glad that I never actually finished doing that. Like, I guess I could have. I guess technically I could have, but it's fine. Let's see how much of a difference this makes. Let's see. Oh, it's actually not that bad. These songs are gonna go hard. I don't know if you can hear them, but I accept. I accept these songs. Okay. I'm gonna go and put I I I need to reorganize my pockets. I don't know what's going on here. We're gonna do that though. Let's look at my storage. I feel like I was here for a certain reason. Minus the room that was being added on the back, but I don't know why I would come back into my house to do that. I do have a lot of weeds because I picked all the weeds that I have. Um, I think I'm good. I don't know. Uh, if this needle will be invited to my first date. Oh, nice. I'm glad. I'm glad for sure. Yeah, I'll have to see. I'll have to see about that for sure. But I'll um update you when I when I uh figure that out. But, oh. He's so cute. We love Sheldon. You guys are hating on Sheldon too much. Okay, I think though. I know technically we have 20 minutes after stream. But I think we've gotten most, like with uh, upgrading my house and stuff, we've gotten most everything we can do today. Especially, I know I, I know I played off stream. I know I probably shouldn't have done that. Um, but I was so super excited. Like you guys, I can't help my excitement. So I had to, I had to play. But um, yeah, I feel like we've, we've accomplished a lot. Got a lot done today. And I'm very ready to see where Retro Hills goes for sure. I'm not, there's no meatball sub included. There is dinner though. I am going to be eating dinner. I'm not trading you guys in. <laughs> um, but I want to say thank you to everybody who has stopped by today's stream. Next time I'll be streaming will be on Monday at 5 p.m. Central Time. We will also be playing Animal Crossing then. And we will also be playing on Retro Hills since we'll have a lot more um, accomplishments done and such then. So stay tuned for that if you want to see that. But if you did enjoy this current stream, I would definitely appreciate a follow or a sub to the channel. It is not required whatsoever, but it is highly appreciated. And then also keep in mind, I will have a new video out on Sunday on my YouTube channel, Polywog Nintendo. So check that out when you get the chance as well. But other than that, I hope you all have a wonderful, wonderful weekend. And I will see you guys Monday. Bye!